Okay, I am sick and fucking tired of hearing this shit. Yo, I'm like, I'm bronze three, but you know, I always get noob teams. I'd be platinum two at least if I, if I didn't get noob teams and trolls and AFKers and fucking feeders every game. And you know, I played an ARAM once, and I was playing against the Diamond Smurf in the enemy team. And I was playing Trindamir, and you know, in the team fight, I just fucking used my E on him, and I fucking killed him. You know, I, I just fucking outplayed him like that, and that obviously means that uh, I'm in the wrong elo. And you know, uh, fucking, I fucking did the math, and it uh, turns out that uh, I'm actually a pro. So I just gotta find the phone so I can use the calculator. What the fuck is this? Uh, oh, here it is. Um. Oh, never mind my background here, but yeah, you know, if you take uh, the, uh, he was diamond two, right? And if you take diamond two and you divide it by uh, bronze three, uh, then you get this. And then you take uh, that times the uh, number of players in the enemy team and uh, divide it by uh, the number of trolls in your team. Uh, then you get the answer. I deserve platinum too, you know? What, what, what? And that represents everyone in bronze and silver, and it might have been a tiny bit over exaggerated, but it's still pretty accurate, I'd say. But the point is, people complaining about their teammates are the only reason that they're still in freaking silver. They have 500 games, they can't seem to climb, but it's always their noob team. Always the AFKers, always the trolls, and they always have to 1v5 because the team is a bunch of retards, and not even Faker can 1v5, so they're stuck in freaking bronze, and they have to get boosted because there's no other way of getting out of ELO hell. But what if there was? With this new 8 months ELO boosting program for only $9.99 an hour, you'll climb out of the fiery pits of bronze hell straight to the heavens of diamond. But wait, I am not done. Order now and your ELO boosting pre-made will always agree with you no matter what mistakes you do. Just so you don't feel like you got completely carried. Contact me at I just want your money at poopmail.com or call 666-420-666. I'm just kidding, I'm not actually boosting anyone. Fuck it, I'm not even diamond. But here's some real math that disproves that you only get noob teams and AFKers in your team. So let's assume that everyone in your game is trolling, except you. You're the better player and you're better than everyone else. Let's call them trolls, even if they might just be bad players, but let's call them trolls. So there are five people who troll in the enemy team, and there are five people in your team who troll. But wait, we forgot that you're in your own team, right? So assuming that you're not a troll yourself, there can only be four trolls in your team. So let's take four divided by five, and we get this. This means that it's 20% less likely that you'll have a troll in your team or it's 20% more likely that there will be a troll in the enemy team. But that still doesn't explain how I always have a troll in my team. You know what? It's because you are the troll. No, but seriously though, the more games you play, in the long run it's gonna even out and you're gonna hit your rank that you deserve. It's like flipping a coin, you can hit the same side of the coin five times in a row, but eventually it's gonna even out, and the more times you throw it, it's gonna land on both sides an equal amount of times, and that's 50%. But, since this is not fucking, you know, flip a coin, this is League of Legends, and you have yourself on your team, and you're a higher rank than your current rank, then you are like one of these cheat coins where or cheat dices or something i don't know if there are any cheat coins but you know one of those dices or coins where you throw them or flip them whatever you do and they land more on one side or for example they land on number six on the dice or something more than all the others you're the cheat look at it that way you're the cheat because you're better than everyone else so in the long run, you should climb if you're good. I hope I explained it well there. I don't know. That was really, that was some really weird metaphors. But um, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you did. Peace.